we played a good game. I'm, I'm more happy about that. I feel like when we start hitting a little adversity, I feel like, you know what I'm saying, we stay together. You know, we've been struggling with this. So. What a way to close out 2021 as the Boston Celtics down the Phoenix Suns with a 123-108 to victory. Marcus Smart was back in the lineup and the Celtics played one of their best halves of basketball that they played all season as they were up by 26 at halftime. And in the second, they continued to steamroll, showing their balanced scoring and also their ability to respond as Rob Williams logged a triple-double. It was a great accomplishment. Uh, thanks to my teammates, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> if they want his shots, I want to have it. We played a good game. I'm, I'm more happy about that. I feel like when we start hitting a little adversity, I feel like, you know what I'm saying, we stay together. You know, we've been struggling with this. So. Rob is great, man. Rob is exceptional. Um, I think he's a really talented player. I think at times, you know, he puts a lot of pressure on himself, similar to me in a sense. But when he come out and play basketball, it's not a lot of people that can, you know, container on both ends. You know, his effect on defense and offense tonight was everybody seen. You know, so we need him to be as consistent as possible. And, and I tell him all the time, don't be afraid to be great. I think Rob had a great night tonight and deserves all the praise he should get. For us, it was really just focusing on getting a great shot. You know, when they punch us, you know, sustaining that punch and punching back. And uh, that's what we did. And, you know, proud of these guys for that. Now, Jalen Brown also mentioned post game that he feels that it was a great team win and they'll be able to build off of it. And they'll look to carry that momentum with them into Sunday when they host the Orlando Magic.